Hello, I'm Tome Keeper Devon, and you're watching Rentech Riders. Before we get into the action, I just wanted to do a quick thank you to our sponsors of uh, Norse Foundry for these lovely uh, dice trays and the dice that we'll be using, as well as Hero Forge for the uh, character portraits, Japanime Games, of course, for the Animaria, and Lynn Vander for the game design. Enjoy the show. Welcome back to Rentech Riders, where our riders are without Rentech. But they have uncovered a deep seated plot to crash the lands of Alicia down onto the uh, surface below. Uh, where we left off, you had a very dead Iltharian soldier who has been interrogated from beyond the grave using interesting dark magic from uh, secretly possessed by one mm. of your <clears throat> own. And. Uh, Eke has obviously also just used his own powers to uncover sort of the fact that there are various uh, powerful figures in the shadows working dark deeds that potentially work their way all the way back to Luna Academy. Your Rentax have been destroyed remotely. You are kind of abandoned and left on this island. The dragon has gone missing, uh, missing as it tried to save you from the blast of the Rentax. Possibly survived, possibly dead, you're not sure. Although if it did survive, it's probably not looking too great. Thank goodness um, we removed all those painful little spiders. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> in exchange for it getting exploded. And, uh, well, he tried to save you. That's not, that's polite. Yeah. 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 decreased. And, uh, the mountain in the distance seemed to be where their base of operations is. So, zooming back in on this small little farmland and the vast reaches far away from civilization, what is your next move? Renaming the show. <laughs> what so is Ren Tech X. Next, <laughs> next move. Ride or dies. <laughs> ride, or, ride or die. Give me a random wing seed. Oh my god. <laughs> the witch from Mercury. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> Iron blooded. Orphans. Mobile suit shogun. <laughs> Mobile suit oh, shogun. Oh, 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 single oh, one. Oh, oh. <laughs> Put your comments below. Please, Mobile suit Gundam was my father. <laughs> <laughs> Don't call me any. What for well, the dragon fell, right? Yeah. What about dragon, dragon fell. fall Z? <gasps> oh my god, I'll watch that. So cool. That's not a good one, right? No. Damn it, Takiri! I put all of my faith in you. My pride is a Saiyan. Dip into the realm of the gods and defeat Jiren. No one watched it. That's a really good Vegeta. Thank you. I was like surprised. I always love that one part in the opening of the Canadian version of Dragon Ball Z, where it's like where you hear Krillin go, "Oh!" when he throws the third destructo disc. It's one thing. It's like you hear like do the one sound effect on the guitar. It's like Dragon, Dragon, go, Dragon, Dragon Ball Z. Ironically, I could never watch that show because it was only on when I was at karate, but I feel like I would have learned more from Dragon Ball Z. I don't know what anyone says. The wind rustles the grass beneath your feet. Grass and wind! Grass and wind? Grass and wind X. No, no, no. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. Uh, there's the smell of the charred corpse. There you go. The yeah. remnants of the, the previously uh, destroyed uh, ship. Yeah, with a little, little uh, short range one person vehicle. Right. Yeah. Smoke billowing off. Is it off. morally ethical for me to eat this corpse? <laughs> it is cooked. I think it'd be a waste of time. the dark secret here? <laughs> what? <laughs> um, well, I don't know what you're talking so, about. So, okay, is actually like quite like still. He received the really crazy news last episode that when he looked into like the past, 
and um, saw the memory of this, the dead corpse that you had animated and realized that um, we're in trouble. <laughs> because in short, again, to reiterate, if these manage these 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 knights, these weave breakers, manage to take the magic away from the floating lands that we stand upon, well, they no longer float. We'd be standing on them down there. That'd be bad. Be bad. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Excellent. We figured it out. Got it. So, have you relayed to us the like the ten people, the like guy struggling yeah. here with the one yeah. eye, the glow? Okay, so we know all this stuff now. Yeah, basically, I, I will have done it, and then it's an add on top that their goal is to make the islands sink, mm. and if the islands sink, they will plummet we'll like comets, and then yes, we would all be in sync. If we put mm. wings on all the islands, they because should be able to float. Need what visions around me. The one in sync song that I was like, I can't. <laughs> Brings tears to my eyes. I look all around me. No, oh, Akin doesn't sing. He's not the bird. <laughs> <laughs> bye, bye, bye. bye, bye. Oh, is that what that's? Yeah. Thank you. I'm like, I know NSYNC, oh, but like, I don't I'm know. The youngest person. Not, the, not chorus. Oh. <laughs> well, that was that was one of the romantic songs they sang. Uh, yeah. We're all just like, tell me, I was born in 2008. I don't know what you mean. Like, <laughs> I'm a 2010 baby myself. <laughs> <laughs> Get out. Thanks for giving us alcohol yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> Perkins, it was really yummy. <laughs> Perkins, <laughs> is that how you went to sleep so early? Perkins, so um, sort of Shogun is. Um, you can see him sort of crouching down by the corpse, and uh, in his mind, he knows that you know he's he's seen studies in these labs where it's like we don't know exactly where you necessarily go, even with whatever you know God you follow if you're a cleric. We don't know what the person's class was, but it might have to do with what your brain is thinking about before you leave. So I'm just like, heck, heck, fire, heck, all the bad things you did, heck, heck, fire. It's like whispering to this thing. A little bean. <laughs> I cool. will wander on over to you. Like, what? Are we not going to give it like last rights? I'd love last rights. All that what I hear about is forced? its last wrongs. What's up? What if it was forced to be mean like the big old dragon? I don't necessarily think so. I merely would have dodged. <laughs> At this stage in the game, Okay. At this point in time. Yeah, what game? <laughs> we're in life. We lost. Like, <laughs> <laughs> we're we'll like, jump simulation <laughs> over. Yeah. At this point in time, they're still believing the ideals and principles of the Syrian Empire. And they don't deserve. Oh. Their goal is to commit mass murder. Word that rhymes with pesticide. Pesticide. So and that's bad. Yes. So we must, pesticides. We must stop this. In its tracks. I believe it is up to us. Go to this mountain. Alright, let's go. Let's save the bees. But <laughs> also, uh. <laughs> We're all walking. Listen, you can walk off the island. I was going to say, a Andy Griffith is a hell of a <laughs> reference to date you. <laughs> we went from NC to the fact up. that you know what that name is and I didn't is even worse. <laughs> <laughs> Just leave it to me. Where we I'm the dungeon master. I'm supposed to know things. Because right. Andy Griffith is still in his dungeon. Um, <laughs> uh, Kyoda pulls uh, Kai aside and says, Hey, Kai, get back there. Oh, you're a pretty secretive guy. Pretty secretive Kai. But it was pretty cool. Oh, thank you. Um, yeah, uh, just trying to do my part. Well, did more than that. I've always thought you were more of a brain guy. Turns out you have brain and fist. Learn from you. Oh, I'm, I'm like really touched. Um, thank you. <clears throat> I'll uh, I'll help you out next time we're in the Mana Labs. Friendship. Yeah, I was gonna say that sounds like uh, some resolve of bonds of friendship. Or no? I actually forgot that was. A th I promised that was not <laughs> just like milk in the friendship. No, that's fine. It's perfect. Though. That's like, what it's. That's what it's for. We need. Kai needs to be okay. Like he just did some spooky magic in front of y'all. I don't know if you're cool with it, but I guess. Yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> I, I, don't know I, I wonder. Try to make a guy imagine. Him. I wonder if Kai has ever done that before, or if this is like just something new you've learned about him. I was like, oh, oh yeah. he can speak to the dead. Apparently, okay. Okay. I, I can't is thinking about the next time he's going to be reading some temporal secrets. <laughs> 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 like, must do a little more research on this troubled youth. 
Like unless it. you're like, unless you're trying to keep it like super secret, like I, th I feel like the Shogun has a lot of like passive perception enough to just pick up on things, but not enough like societal awareness to be like, that's weird and you're not supposed to. It's just like, yeah, this guy he just goes talks to graves sometimes. Like that's sometimes I shoot this guy trying to kill the. Like sometimes you're in a completely random situation, you just see me do something weird and just never mention it. Yeah, I mean, I'm a, I'm a dinosaur. He's sitting there, in a, like, blood, <laughs> sitting there in a circle of blood with like a plucking a chicken. <laughs> It's like yeah. chanting words, you're like, that's Kai. Yeah. Hey, blood's gotta be some shape, you know? I think that's cool as hell. Yeah, pretty metal. Bring oh, God. Iron in the blood. Yeah. Orphan. So I look at the mountain. I, I use the little spyglass. You yep. can't, so. as, as far as you could tell looking at it through the spyglass, it just looks like a mountain. You did see a bit of a shimmer when the, the, uh, the, the scouts came out, but it does just look like a mountain. Mm. No, no, it's a real mountain. <laughs> I can confirm from Takiri. It's my specialty. There has to be a cave inside. Heard of them? But I believe that the, the whole... appearance of the mountain still a mountain, but sealed by something magical with no sense if it's... Something more complicated is afoot. Mm -hmm. Speaking of... Start using... But feet have many bones, and I'm tired, and unless I take a little nap, I am boned. Okay, I can give you a piggyback. Uh, we should, we should, perhaps we should rest for one hour. I can also give you a piggyback. I know, you carried me. You carried me for nine months. Now it's my turn to carry you, Mom. Bro. I don't know, I was going for something. Am I your mom? I got so my brother. It's really weird because you kissed in the last episode. <laughs> I kissed my dad on the lips, it's fine. <laughs> You're right. I'm sorry. Love is rich. No don't more. be weird. Don't my bad, Kyoto. Don't my bad. Go back to talking to the dead and don't be weird. Are you, are you suggesting taking a, a long rest? Yeah, just for like an hour. Yeah. <laughs> for like, I love this new rule, the hour long rest. Mm. Get, is that, okay. yeah. Since I'm getting the power back, just I'll open up a portal in time, and I'll reach in, and, and you'll see, you'll see, you'll actually see at this point that the time portal opens up, and you see another version of Eke in there. He's sitting at a tavern with y'all, and he's sitting at the tavern, and he's just, just ordered this big plate of like cheese and fruit, and he just goes <sighs> and turns and hands it through the portal to this Ekka. Our evil twins. And he goes, he takes it, and then the portal goes away, and the other Ekka is like, they have another. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll pull from tomorrow a plate of cheese and fruit for everyone to eat. A time. Oh wow! Thank you. And that power, that power is a Mario power where you can go and pull an item from the past to the future. Yeah, but so far all of you done with it is whole charcuterie. <laughs> yeah, truly. <laughs> Yesterday, today. Fox, Fox has got to eat. You know? <laughs> I don't know if you've heard of spinach, but it's also good for building muscle. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. so, so, yeah. It just keeps feeding its cheese. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Nothing but cheese. I, 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 so blah, I am corked I have right been shot three days. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So That's when it happens, like, oh. we're building pressure. Rocket punch <laughs> this, out the ass. This is going to be the weirdest the final enemy. battle at the end. Yeah. We totally have to think of it that way. Oh, no. <laughs> eat your brie, eat your brie. Oh, soft cheese. Just pick me up, amen. <laughs> <laughs> and we will have chatter and Jenner. We uh, rest for the hour. You ever seen those birds that like will stand over a pond go like this with their wing? Yeah. Fish, uh -huh. I'm gonna do that with my wing. Roll up. It's <laughs> cool. Nice. That's how I'm gonna sleep. So you get, yeah, you, you take a little bit of a breather, kind of gather your surroundings. Now, um, you could definitely get to the mountain on foot. It is going to be a bit of a journey uh there will be some potential jumps you're gonna have to make across oh we'll just run into our rentex oh wait mm -hmm. uh, tommy if only oh. we had wings if only had wings. well so this is the thing yeah i mean <laughs> you? Re realistically any major um pitfall type obstacles you could as we've established carry the party across so uh with, with a bit of a, a bit of a sojourn you could make your way to the mountain i believe it's called toe the party line so yeah so yeah. we'll We'll make our way. Uh, you also do have a ranger whose favorite terrain is mountain, so... Mm -hmm. I love them. They're so... They're so aggressive against the ground. <laughs> they reach up to the heavens, as I do. Uh, question eight for you, Eke. Yeah. Um, I know you seem concerned about it before. Don't worry, the sick safety zone. Mm -hmm. um, the, uh, I still got these four little pokey uh, glowy uh, sticks mm -hmm. just sort of chilling in here. Have you never experienced Rennick before? Well, clearly not. I'm asking you a question. Pluck one out with your hand. Does it hurt? Yeah, you do. 
arm falls clean off. <laughs> hey, look at so, that. As you touch it, it you kind of get like this, like, like it's a bit of um, bit of an ache in, in your finger. It's actually not that bad. Um, Don't hmm? they have mana laden? Monk. Uh, so it's, there's a little bit of an ache to it, but it's 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 not the worst. It definitely doesn't feel nice, but it's not like awful. An ache you get. Yeah. <laughs> No no, 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 don't eat that. Uh, not for food. Uh, what I will do is get you to make a constitution. <laughs> I'm too close to it's your like, mouth. It's like putting your tongue on the on a square battery to see if it's. Mm-hmm. No, 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 no. I used to do that all the time as a kid. What kind of say? <laughs> constitution. <laughs> uh, so the rest of you see as uh, Takiri's kind of skin gets a little paler, uh, a little sallow. Um, the Magnolian. veins begin to kind of bulge out slightly. There's like sort of greenish uh, the, the tendrils, ten, like a rivulets kind of like running along like from their finger where they're touching it. Uh, and okay. you, you feel a little, a little withered. Um, and for the duration of you holding on to this thing, uh, two things are going to happen. One is that uh, any healing you receive will only give you temporary age. You won't actually be able to recover hit points. And the second thing is that uh, your uh, save DC for your key things goes down by two, oh. which means that it's easier for people to resist various, like your stunning strikes and things. He looks not very well. I don't think that was the right thing to suggest. No, <laughs> I don't it, feel awesome. It will pass. Point is, understand the feeling that this arthritic steel is. It's because you have mana with the nails that affecting you. Put it, put it, put it back in the gun, please. Be safe and touch the gun. Uh, I do want to say um, none of that you had to do. You could that part you said just now. But if you timed it before the touch, why did you let that happen to Takiri? I did. I asked you you to grab it. <laughs> you. Oh, wow, that's true. Okay. After Just, one minute, it will flush itself yeah, through your yeah, so system. He, we, we start, when he starts to get better, I will say, it will pass. <laughs> but I feel like you need it as a student. Understand what you're going to be dealing with. It took down a dragon. We know. <laughs> we did take down the dragon. But do you? I'm still alive. <laughs> you are still dragon. my charge. It's my job to teach you the things that you need to learn. I did not expect your lessons to include Renick Steel. Mm. Or the uh, Exiltherian Empire. Weave breakers are no joke. This is not a simulation. The harsh truths must be given. Renick steel touching your skin will do things to you that you just saw with Takiri. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I, I pull out my notebook and insert just right now. Okay. Yeah, but I've never encountered Renick steel before. This is, is some important stuff. Good job, Leonardo. <laughs> What's he got to be um, but he's the teacher's pet. He just puts yeah, it yeah. 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 It's like, Is this uh, gonna. My, is my skin gonna match again? Yeah, yeah it is. Right. It's, the down, color is beginning down. to return, yes. Oh. Your melatonin's back. Uh, yeah. yeah, that's what I meant to say. <laughs> Lucky you. Um, I, a question. I do have a few things of like rope, things like that. Can I take these out of my gun and safely store them in like a satchel of some kind? Yes. I would like to make ammo out of them later. Yeah, yeah, very mm-hmm. good. Nice, yeah. good. Yeah. Yeah. That's a thing. Yes, yeah. yeah that, okay, that stuff cool. eventually does wear off. Yeah. Well, so it's no longer in my gun, and we're going to pretend that it mm-hmm. wasn't when I fired this 300 feet. That the is firewall. Hilarious. Yeah, you know, they were, yeah, they were there on the side. They were, they oh, God. Yeah, that, that, that would have that caused the gun to cease functioning. Yeah. Oops. That is so yeah. funny. I waited until we were like a day in an episode later. I'm like, by the way, <laughs> I shuffled them out. Retcon. And then them in, yeah. Yeah. Retcon riders. No. Nope. Retcon, Retcon riders. riders. <laughs> we yeah. just gaslight the audience the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> we were never sent on any mission. <laughs> what are you talking about? Remember that scroll of wishes you got? Yeah. I was but always very intelligent. Yeah. <laughs> Indubitably. It's me, it's a Gary. I like that accent you always had. Yes, thank you. Riders. How do we spell Renick? So I know R E N I K. Thank you. Uh, yep. That almost actually screwed me up. <laughs> 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 Ramen Riders. Ra- so yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll carry you up the mountain, and he can mountain himself up. Uh, you can watch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And Poodle can fly. Yeah. That's true. 
Yeah. <laughs> we just said so sad about it. <laughs> I want to hang out on somebody's shoulder. So, a few oh, things of note. Okay. There are a few lessons you must learn about Renick. While they possess this in their hands, they have the ability to cancel your spells. Careful. Fine. Hmm. You two, magic. Could you use magic? Try to stand 31 feet. <laughs> Everything I've done so far, like blowing things up, I've always called it dinosaur karate. You telling me that's a type of magic? Yes. It's a skill of... They can... They have... Tyranna... Tyrannus foo. Fight against. <laughs> that's... That's... No so offense of you, <laughs> to the Ferndorar people. Yes. That's the most Tyrannus X foo. Whatever. Oh, no. it's like, what the hell's it called? The Tyrannosaurus. There you go. You want to get this guy? Tyrannosaurus. You want to fucking get this guy? I got this. It's the anti-fighting dinosaur corrupt. He didn't name it. Of course not. Good. But I those those guys then it did. So that kid's like, yeah. he's, uh, he's saying stuff to gaslight he's, them to get the whole up against the others. I'm going to pray to God. Hey, God, would this affect my key? No. Okay. I'll other, other, down. Than, other than in the fact that if you are like, withered by their weaponry, it does decrease your DC um, to save against things like stunning strikes and whatever. But key is channeled through your, your strength of will and soul okay. uh, and taps into the veil. So it is... On and the my strikes are magical now. I'm able to that, yeah, that, that, that that's yeah. That awesome. they count I as they, they count as magical for the purposes of reduction. They are not actually magical. Okay. Did you guys all just see God come down? <laughs> oh, I guess that's the one correct religion. Yeah. Let's not specify. So Kiri has the power to actually summon God. And he's like, "Excuse me, God!" And there's a giant shadow of the land. Oh, thank you. you. Use that. Use that. We realize, we realize it's just one of the islands above us. This fall straight up, just on a Python Holy Grail. It's the clouds parse. Yeah. Oh, whoa, yeah. Oh. What's, what's two plus two? Oh, thank you. Sure. And that's all I use it for. Five. <laughs> <laughs> Uh boy. All right, so we begin our track down towards the mountain. Um, kind of wary for anti-magic, magic illusions. Yeah. Yeah. Because I can't be surprised here on these mountains. That's right. Not and I can't party. be surprised ever. That's I'm right. your son. <laughs> That's your mom? Yeah. <laughs> uh, a couple of hours pass as you make your way across the terrain on foot. Like peasantry. What? I guess that's gonna make our ankles all sorus. <sighs> that was bad. Oh, that's right. No, I meant it. Don't applaud that. I, I, I may mean, not. Uh, uh, I'm Take a resolve. <laughs> that was tyrannorific. Oh. Uh, uh, I'm leaving? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we're gone. <laughs> we're at that stage in the show. Yeah, start of the day. <laughs> what is your plan as the mountain grows closer and you begin to approach into the foot? How do you intend to find your way? We have a mountain range. I, I know. So but what is the plan, Mountain Ranger? Yes, plan, Mountain Ranger. <laughs> oh, shit. Um, <laughs> all right. We must I'm going to look for any... Oh, sorry. We, no, we must search. We must... Uh, yeah. So I was going to say we must search. Uh, I'm going to look for any... <laughs> smart, smart. I'm going to look for any discrepancies in this mountain. I know a lot about mountains, and if anything looks different about it, I would know. Good. Uh, give me perception. Got it. While he's doing that, I'm going to... Up closer now that we're closer to it, I'll see if I can get a better vantage. You can get perception as well. Um, that is a 19 percent. Okay. I've, I've received the Kai curse. Hmm. You, you take out the spyglass, and all you, just, all you see is a very nice zoomed in picture of rock. You're like, <laughs> I'm very close. Makes sense. Uh, four. Yeah. Yeah. I see, like, I just see, like, Kai's face. Oh. <laughs> Too close. Oh, no. I lied. My proficiency bonus is double. Yeah, so I figured it was so probably going to be a really good texture. 20. There is, in fact, a passageway that is designed to look like the rock. It is very skillfully done, but of course, you have skillful eyes. Mm -hmm. And you can see that the, the way the rock formations move, there is a little teeny bit of a seam of some kind of door mm. built into the rock face. Something is amiss, it seems. It seems. Let's take that back. Never mind. 
Does it look like a famous actor? It sure does. That's no Dwayne Johnson, though. Let's scooch on past. It's a false rock. <laughs> Let's met up more for ourselves inside. Oh, more. <laughs> I'm withering. I don't want to walk anymore. My knee <laughs> is hurt. Oh. Sit a minute, oh. my dear Watson. I do believe I found the rock. Let's go. I'd take psychic damage. No, not a pod. You didn't live forever. I said he was going to live forever. He had one health. <laughs> um, so I am going to walk to the front of this area, but I also want to scan for traps. Um, okay. <laughs> oh, let's all pretend I've never played this game for a minute. I'm in a mood today. You gave me coffee and breakfast. Let's go. That's fine. You're the leader. That's fine. You're the leader. Uh, cool. Yeah. Uh, I mean, again, expertise, I guess, on whatever you'd like to do. Perception, investigation, survival. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do perception again. If that's sure. Right. Yeah, yeah. That is. Uh... So it says double proficiency bonus. So I've got a plus six next to perception, but my proficiency bonus is plus four in general. So, so it'd be a plus eight. It'd be plus eight. Got it. Got it. Okay. Um, so that would be 21. It'd be plus eight plus your wisdom bonus. Plus my wisdom bonus. So then, yeah. Um, so, plus 10, so that would be 23. Okay. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it's very competent. So the... Sometimes. The, the, the mountain door here um, doesn't seem to have anything that, but the ground around it uh, is definitely rigged way. it doesn't look like there's anything like lethal but there is like a like a pitfall kind of thing I see um, and there would also appear to be uh, you can also make out that there is like a mechanism that seems like it would open the door but you can't see any way to open it from the side got it All right everyone be careful on the ground from the rock we would drop if we were to step Fresh. But let's make sure we can get inside using the mechanisms that are around here. I don't see it right away. Perhaps magical expertise are needed. I've just found out I have magic. <laughs> well, sight. So you don't notice anything magical, but you do, however, notice that there are, are voids of magic. Because the air itself, like, m mana flows throughout the world, and so oftentimes there's sort of a a permeating amount of it, just a very subtle amount in the air itself, but you can see that there are voids lacking that uh, concentrated that run uh, just kind of along the edge of this door. Um, and you can kind of follow that around uh, as it then comes out to another block a little bit of a distance away, kind of just thing that sticks out that appears very similar to the secondary door. It's not like a door size. It's like approximately the size of like an orange, just kind of protruding from the side of the mouth. Like a, like a push button. Probably. Made of, I find out. Uh, made of what appears to be rock. But there like is void on it. There is a little bit of a, there is like um, like a void that comes out and there's a little bit of uh, of it kind of just protruding from end. So it's like kind of like you could like tap it and... With us, if we're like, it, in order to, to activate it out, you'd have to touch the Renick. That's right. Something else would have of a gun. Um, I'll explain this to you. <laughs> Your monk. <laughs> I'll explain this all to you. Um, and and, sh and sort of like the area before it, though. You said that there was the false rock, so we fall. So yes. This is a pit trap. To you have to know how to. I, I, yes, good. I touch. But be careful. I would use something um, like a branch. Or, My but hands. yeah, well, no, because then that. Melatonin deficiency will happen. It, it came back. Yes, but we don't want you to be stuck in case behind the wall. Hmm. Don't worry. More importantly, <laughs> before so, we need to figure out how to get across without the rocks falling. Eh, carry us across then. All right. Yeah. Sounds good to me. Great. Great. I touch. It does seem to give that as you press forward, the false door does begin to slide open as the edges around of it just kind of like glow green and it slides to the side. You also, um, I would say for, for Shogun, you see like kind of the, the floor in front of it just kind of solidify slightly. It seems a lot less fragile. Mm. Um, at the same time, uh, you hear sort of like a, a, th a thrumming whoosh from above and kind of looking up you see like a bunch more 
of those short range vehicles with riders kind of come out from somewhere on the top of the mountain. They're not coming toward us, huh? No, they're heading out towards where the last ones were heading. Quick, we've got to get inside. Those haters above us are going to hate that we're here. Like a water sliding. So you head into this passageway, which appears to be carved out of the rock, um, and it is dark, but those of you with dark vision can see that it only extends for just a little bit. And as you go forward, you emerge out into what appears to be an area that has been lined with like steel. There are like beams and trusses and all sorts of different types of things within the mountain. It's been like hollowed out and it seems like there's like reinforced steel used to kind of keep everything supported. Is it green steel? Um, it's sort of, a, it's tinged, but it's not like solid green. You're guessing it's an alloy of some kind. Dark in here? Um, yes. It's starting to get brighter. I don't. Oh, I was gonna say there is there is like lights and the, there there are there are, um, there are metallic lanterns that are bolted into the stone wall, which are glowing like this dim, sickly green that kind of illuminate everything in this similar color. So it's this low green uh, illumination around the uh, the chambers here, and uh, I would say for you, Eke, with your sight, the 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 metal is sort of somewhat. Voided, and you can see like little bits of magic mana in the air, kind of just into like different parts of the of the metal, but just ever so slightly. Do I know what this would do to spell casting? Uh, it would prevent divination from getting anywhere inside here. Uh what? Can it- don't worry, we're, 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 don't worry about it. <laughs> can, I, can I test something too? Yeah, sure. Uh, you said that there's like a little green sort of flame there. Uh, it, what's like a lantern? So a it's lantern. like it's like it's like it's there's like um, piece of glass and then that is is or metal or something. It's glowing green aluminum. There you go. All right. To test that, I want to use thaumaturgy to cause flames to brighten and see if it does. Not. So it like kind of flickers, but it does it, it does come up. It's it's like a split second slower than it you seems to be working fine. Perhaps we should definitely check out. I'll protect us from anything coming up behind us. I will begin the minute cast of alarm, and I will trace it into the dirt behind us, so that way when we're further in, if something comes in through that side, we'll know that there's more enemies coming by. Uh, as you begin to... Sorry, is there something you want to... How big is Ru? Oh, it's quite tall. It's like a 20-foot tall Can you area. sneak in air? You could, yes. Um, for sneak? Yeah, go for it. Yeah. 15. Okay. Uh, so as you begin to kind of settle this stuff up, uh, you hear a very calm voice just call out to you from around the corner. <clears throat> Do I see what I see? You are students. You do not belong here. And stepping out from the shadows, wearing the olive green armor from that y'all had previously seen, um, an eye patch, maybe a hairstyle that's a little familiar. Maybe mm, you have a hairstyle, I think. Whatever fabulousness, either of you two. I don't know what you got, but I think you had like a mohawk, which is amazing. Yeah, yeah. I got like a shorter mohawk. Um, and he is short, squat, very buff, covered in scars. Um, one really dramatic scar from like one eye socket down to the neck. And with his hands on his hips, he gets out and looks at you all. I am so disappointed in you all. Get over here! Get into the shadows right now! Sorry about that. You know who that is? No idea. <clears throat> Sounds like some danger from a stranger. Um, yeah, I'm just I'm gonna roll with it as if like I totally understand what's happening. Yep. Yeah, my bad. I'm just gonna start. Do you know how long I've been working on this operation? And then you come in here dressed like commoners? You, you are from the... You have not even changed. Sorry, sir. It's It's been a... It's Where's been a, your cover? Uh, we, is there, we, is we, there somebody else here? I'll try and hide. I mean, I'm small enough to see if I can just slip into the shadows. Okay, sure. So using my Night Stalker, Fox. Well, Delph. Is he looking at me? I can hear you if you're talking. 29. Okay. <laughs> so you sort of just like... Into the shadows, abandoning your charges. What? what? Not abandoning. <laughs> I'm, I'm also going to use nature's because so far only Kai has interacted with this. 
and I mean, I know you're. Yeah, so far, just yes. Walked I mean, they've walked in, but you, uh, you could. They could walk in. Well, it's just really could, dim, and you have one eye. So I, I was going to say, <laughs> you could still, like, just. Yeah. If you wanted to, yeah. Well, if they've seen me, are they aware that I am there? Would they be seeing me go just go, like, uh. <laughs> Hey, you can do what you want to do. I'm already disappointed. Um, Honestly, yeah. Worse, Mom. <laughs> you can't disappoint me anymore. Right? I'm mad. I'm yeah. Disappointed. Oh god. Uh, so I'm just gonna say, um, my gears in the barracks. Apologies if, like, you know, theory and salute. <laughs> <laughs> he returns it. Um, my name is Commander Rex. I've been an operative here for so long now. I, I haven't even seen anybody from back at the base. How are things? Sorry, Commander Rex, he looked at... Oh my god. <laughs> We've just sent out several scouting parties to see what the commotion was. Uh, something happened with the dragon. I just went to go make sure routes were clear. Dragon still... Uh, they went to go confirm, I'm not sure. <sighs> what exactly is your purpose here? Where... <sighs> there was more of you. Uh, I believe they went out to just... Check out the, the front grounds. Cannot have you all wreck this operation for me. I have nothing to return with. I have been watching. I have been studying. I have been spying. And the things that I have seen, you should not be here. You really the one to be watching and spying and all the... Are you, are you making an eye joke? I'm not Son, making Son, are you joke. making an eye joke? I'm not making a me joke. He would never say something like that to a superior officer. Very well, soldier. <laughs> Now, to begin, you all need to get in disguise. I can't have you walking around here. You look like students. Look like... Just under my breath. <laughs> like, just, he doesn't like authority. So. <laughs> Couldn't tell. You're right, sorry, with all of the commotion, we just kind of skipped formality. How did you even get here? Uh, well, same as you. Wait, where was your rent deck? Um, that... Uh, there, uh, there was some complication. Fortunately, they're under repair. Are they outside the base? <laughs> I mean, it's <laughs> a matter of speaking. Yes, yeah. <laughs> really, they're all around us. To be honest, so many ways. I left them in the hands of the engineers. I have not followed up. Understood. One second, and he kind of falls back into the shadows. You hear some rummaging, so like the sounds of like armor a little bit. And he pulls out some, probably just some like what do you call like a uniform that's just like your your casual uniform as soldiers, like your fatigues. Fatigues. fatigues yeah. Thank you. Um, pulls out fatigues. I think I heard. <laughs> um, it only has three. Mm -hmm. One really small one for the fox that was there. Um, this is for your third. I'll hand the other two to you. Thank you. Dress up, act the part. Yes, sir. And you said, please. <laughs> I put it on over my also like already duster jacket. Wreck this for me. There's no going back. I can't get back in here. You have no idea how, was dif how difficult it was to get to this base. You kind of just walked. Just walked from the mess hall. We were grabbing lunch before this. Yes. We're not going to focus on that right now. What we're going to focus on is the mission. Yes. What is your task? I take it away. <laughs> we were put on standby after arriving. I assume that was probably for you. <laughs> yes, no, that sounds about right. Let me brief you. Okay, good. Ask questions. I guess like, ask <laughs> Questions. Ask questions. That's bad when I do it. You talk. To be fair, last episode you told them not to ask questions. Yeah, if we had to kiss. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah. Now he's like, ask the questions. No kissing. Talk Why are you listening to me now of all time? You talked about poison metal by having us touch poison metal. <laughs> Like a dad from the 30s. Yeah. <laughs> I'll let him touch the stove. Do you want to smoke, kid? Yeah, have a whole pack. <laughs> so if you eat the lead, you'll learn your lesson in 30 years. <laughs> I'm like ready to go with the dart, which probably wouldn't do anything. Sounds okay. good. Well, I'm going to also be like, hey, can I have an extra pair of fatigues in case I get smaller and more these? Uh... <laughs> yeah. Thanks. Sure. No, I mean, I've heard weirder things. Is that, is that common? Does that happen? It could not happen. <laughs> I'll pull out a Takiri sized uniform, not knowing. Fuck, <laughs> oh, I'm a dinosaur. 
I don't know. I'm like probably like nine foot ten. No, I'm kidding. Like six feet. Uh, yeah, six yeah, feet. It's, yeah. It's, yeah. It's, it's medium pretty, creature, but as large as me. Pretty tall, it's probably. Yeah. yeah. Some faffs. Um. So, what do you all know about the reactor here? Uh, we were briefed that we would be, um, perhaps guarding the reactor, but we know nothing about it specifically. <sighs> like they, they pinch the bridge of their nose. This is gonna go terribly. This reactor is rigged to explode. It can be done with magic. Uh, you all look pretty competent. Ink. Um, he was chosen for his abilities, not necessarily his wit. <laughs> look that up and see what you mean. Um, question. So I, I would love to do, if I could, like an insight. Yeah, go for it. Because I am yeah, curious as to, um, I'm getting the vibe that like this person has been undercover for us without us realizing and we've stumbled upon an ally, but I'm not sure yet. Yeah, I'm going so, the same route. Oh, okay, cool. I thought this was... Uh, 14, 14 plus um, inside I said. Mm -hmm. uh, that's a dirty 20. Uh, I think you're probably kind of in the right mindset. Okay. They, they, they definitely seem like your backup or reinforcements or something for something that they're doing and they keep referring to like their operation, their mission, not mm. like our and, and, and we. And so it does, they do seem to be giving off vibe of like there may be something else going on here the thing that we've um, stumbled upon it would it would is, it would it it. kind of it, it, you think you, you roll pretty well um <laughs> the uh, if it. there's a lot of commotion going on outside there's explosions and things happening with the dragon if there was an agent working inside this facility it probably want to go figure out what's going on and so mm -hmm. they may have been kind of keeping an eye on the entrances just to see if there was any kind of assault or uh, military mm -hmm. operation that maybe they were unaware of that they should kind of hurt themselves into and then when you up they were aghast that you were just <laughs> plain clothes uh, academy students walking through an Otharian facility and have now taken it upon themselves to kind of get that taken care of before a patrol shows up or anything this yeah, is more is. like actual legitimacy what did you get i got 22. all right 22. so you get all of that Wait, but 22. You also, as you are a worldly and and uh, a little bit more well no well knowing about the world itself, uh, you recognize that when they um, have arrived and you've been peering and examining from your cover position, and you've seen that every now and again they they move their body in a way that seems innocuous, but they do it kind of. They keep trying to do like they do like they, they do this, or or it's kind of like. Do that mid conversation, and then they kind of like look the eye the party, and when they don't, and then they kind of seem like they're they're not sure, and then they do that again, and then they kind of eye the party, and it's almost as if they're expecting something, even though they're just sort of like innocuously touching them, touching their face or elbow or something like this every now and again, which I think Eke might know. It's also he doesn't know what those things mean, right? But he knows what that could be, which would be all sign. Uh, I want all the news, so I'm going to use this, mm. Tech Thoughts, Ooh, and uh, I want to know when they're doing the symbols, what they're look. I want to read what they're looking for. So Surface Thoughts, yeah. Uh, basically, yeah, when, if you're, if you're waiting until like they do like yeah. this again, they're trying to ascertain, basically, are you with the Diamond Skull? Right. Um, you know, are you an agent? Um, and, and, and they're not getting a res any response back, obviously. So they, <laughs> then you get like a lot of like confusion and disappointment, and mm -hmm. more like they're just focused on. Okay, maybe they're not with 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 my organization, but they can't be. I can't be seen with them. Like right. like they're, they're going to jeopardize this whole operation. All right, well, then I will. But pop also, you get maybe I can use. Hmm. But I will pop out of the shadows. Yeah. Like you yeah. are not of the skull. Up asking. Smarter than you look. <laughs> I told that my whole life. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. But we are allies. The oh. enemy of my enemy is my friend. In three lefts make a right. Like I said, I have I so. a task. Two, potentially, if you are up to it. I have been unable to secure the blueprints for this reactor. It needs to explode. This base cannot exist. 
this base is a threat to all of us. Is there a small exhaust port? <laughs> <laughs> I've been looking at it. I guess I would! Yeah! I understood that. Someone need a hell of a shot. Approximately the size of a wombat. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I understood that. What? Go work, Cap. It does establish that Luke was just yeah. shooting a bunch of animals. It for does, yeah. Right. Right. I'm just like, yeah. All right. That's your hobby. I mean, it's like, a pretty messed ceiling. up kid, man. His dad is Darth Vader. But... <laughs> I did not have a good go at it. I'm coming in. Okay. I'm going to drop so you kind of just... Yeah, spoiler, guys. Sorry. I'm just going to super heal in. I'm like... I bet you didn't see me coming. It's bad for your knees to do that. <laughs> I uh, heard you up there. Didn't I'd expect. Regardless, I have a task for you, and you are a part. You're with them, right? You're, this is not like a... Try to redo all No, this. we're less surprised than you right now. <laughs> These are my guys. Understood. Men. There are blueprints that you can acquire. I have been unable to get these myself, but they have all of the information on how this reactor can be detonated. That's what you can do, or... There is some correspondence I have been itching to read. I need to know who is involved. Who are the names? Is there somebody on the other side that we don't know about? I, I've been placed here for almost a year now. Correspondence is in who are in charge. Yeah. Who they're talking to. Something has not been adding up. I'll spill out all the information from the vision I saw. Which you've told oh. us before too, right? Yes. Yeah. I'm like, speaking of which, hmm? I'm sorry to ask this. But to earn our trust, and I see what's under that patch, and whether or not it glows. Oh, uh, it's kind of gory. Oh, I love. It. Let's see it. <laughs> and they lift up their eyes. We all just start puking. <laughs> I like. I take a second. I'm just like. Why are we? We're all puking. Oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> Can I put my finger in there? Oh, yeah, yeah. Maybe after we've uh, become better acquainted. Those are soldier. called intrusive thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I just had to check. Yeah. Because someone described something to me once and I had a hunch. Good hunch. I didn't actually <laughs> no. piece that together. <laughs> Pretty flat back there. Oh, thank you. But it's not glowing. No. no. You got us. <laughs> well, are you willing to help? I may, I may not speak. Peoples. Will there be violence involved? A lot of violence. <laughs> I'm in! <laughs> I would prefer stealth, but if you're here, then I know that's not going to be me. I am a sly and stealthy hunter. It's true. I've seen them be stealthy. I heard them talking up there. When you were all... But well, you didn't like... see me talking up no, soldier, I did not see you. Because uh, they were on your right side. Uh, question. Um, <laughs> uh, I know, it's pretty bad. Um, I'll probably regret it later. Um, it's okay, I'll just patch the film. Thank you. Yes, yeah, constant cuts. To... No, I, I, I got it. I got it? <laughs> oh, shut up. Oh, oh, wow. All right, put a lid on again. You call us your pupils. Um, um, I wish I didn't say it. It's getting so corny. Um, um, no, okay. uh, it's just going to give us a real lashing on that one, huh? I know, I've got some real optic nerve. Um, so, the question for you, one final question. Um, these haters in the green outfits, they're yes. acting under their own willpower, correct? Uh, yes, I mean, like, they're responding to commands. But they signed up for this position and believe in the things that they're doing for the most part? Yes. Okay, we'll do a violent at them. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, Aniki. They're not particularly people that are helpful, kind, uh, wish a long future for like us. Like us. Yeah. I risk them dead. No. <laughs> nice. Nice. All right, so do some before he lets you go. Can I just, what are your names? So if I make it out of here, I can report back. Hi. Go. Call sign Big Fist. Er, me? I go by many names. I just need one. Yoda. Perfect. The sawed off Shogun. That was three. Also known as Yoda, the final living survivor of Dinosaur Karate. Never told you all this, but every practitioner of Dinosaur Karate before me always died. You did tell us this. Oh. What? Yeah. You didn't tell me. Oh, yeah. I'm the last one left. The curse of Dinosaur Karate. Your teeth die. No. 
I hope you don't die on this mission, because that sure. would jeopardize my position. She would have my name. Uh, yeah, thank you. If you let me touch the hole in your eye, you can call me Takiri. <sighs> no, thank you. Mm. No. I respect your boundary. <laughs> yeah. This is such an anime conversation. <laughs> <laughs> well, I have my mission. What would you two, uh, what would you four like to accomplish? Violence. Either get me the blueprints or the correspondence. Of the party. <laughs> yeah! This is not a You place. take the flashlight and explore the woods. I'll go take a shower. <laughs> we just change genres. <laughs> Um, I want to be in the a sequel. fox flashlight. What? Oh, it's a flashlight. Oh, torch. Is it called torch again? Flashlight. 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 Yeah. flashlight. Yeah. I, don't I heard something torch. else. Oh, sorry. I, yeah. I heard that too. I, but I, 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 I heard that too. I was like, like whoa. 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 And then when he said, "We'll switch whoa. genres," I was like, oh. "Hard left turn." No, it's like a horror movie. <laughs> it was a hard left turn. <laughs> Shower. You take that. Okay. Yeah. Anyway. Anyway. <laughs> Let's get the. the okay, I'm glad I wasn't the only one that heard that. Sorry. We'll get the blueberries. Should you choose to accept this mission? <laughs> and we'll detonate in 30 seconds. Huh? Who? Right, team. So Which the blueprints blue? will show us the layout of this place, but the correspondence will show us who's responsible. The, let's get the people. Yeah, I think it's going to be more important to have uh, a correspondence list, especially if we blow up this place, because it's not going to really matter what it looks like when they look like change. Mm. And you're all familiar with, like, who's here? No. Yes. What? Generals. Told us. Oh, oh, you're familiar with the ten generals. I just told you. Oh, you did. You did recap that, and I was totally active attention. listener. You're not that smart, are you? I am office? your commanding officer. Oh, my bad. Sorry. Yeah, for now. <laughs> for now. Are you going to be next? I'm going to promote myself right now. So, oh. to get the blueprints, if we're going to destroy everything, why would we want the blueprints? Because then that tells you how to destroy. This reactor is not your run of the mill. Magic crystal. No wombat hole. I, I'm not familiar with wombats. All right. We'll do it. Yes? See? Yes. See? Uh, y'all. Yeah. yeah? Did you want to go for the blueprints or the correspondence? Yes, in Chinese. <laughs> no, no, you want to hear it? Sure. 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 Okay. Uh, can we not do both? Uh, Is that all right? Can we do uh, both? These halls are not safe. If you can survive even making it to get the blueprints, I'd be impressed. My option menu is only letting me. Yeah. I know. I hate when they make that railroading us. I say correspondence because I want to kick some ass. Correspondence first. Yeah. Blueprints after. Yes. Be ashamed to see a mountain go away like that. Correspondence first. Uh, I'm just going. Whole base. I'm going to interject as DM here as well. As a, one of the DMs. Uh, if we also are going to rig the reactor to blow, you may want to. Helps to get out. There's always a way out. There is. It yes. Depends on what dimension true. you wish to reside in. After. Uh, well, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> We'd be the first time a dinosaur turned a mountain into a volcano. <laughs> Let's see, we go through the top. <laughs> Fireball. <laughs> All right. All right. Please don't jeopardize this for me. You never saw me here. No, we did, though. Well, I stepped slightly to your right, and I'm like, you don't see me now. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, think, okay. Slink by, and he'll slink back into the shadows. Boy. He was very, he was scolaring me with the conversation. Enough! <laughs> ah! My apologies. I'll have a better red to that later with my conversations. Shall I'm we... also falls over. <laughs> <laughs> Shall right, we continue right. down this tunnel with our vision? <laughs> yes. Let's go. Wait. Wait. Where are we going? Uh, yeah. So the <laughs> the reactor is located in the uh, bottom. That's one of my favorite scenes. Bro. Beneath <laughs> this beneath this floor, whereas the correspondence would be on the upper floor. Must go up. Uh, in the uh, in the offices. <laughs> Who leads? Um. Why are you now? Uh, you've all been given uniforms to wear. Are you putting those on? I'm currently wearing one. I think you're the only one that is. I think you're the only sad. one that actually said that you put it on. I said I put it on over my duster, oh, yes. but I think it's, it's clear that it's like so it's just kind of like, like this it's kind of just like on, <laughs> like as opposed to like me wearing it. I'm just like I'm draped on. Like you. wearing that lame thing. Is he beautiful sage gray or what is it? Are you wearing like that olive, olive green? Beautiful olive, olive green. It's a beautiful green. <laughs> Probably should too. They have like um, like orange patches on them with a the number. Yours is like uh, uh, 
Sure. 67. Nice. Yeah. 420 will be. Oh, you took it from me. <laughs> you can have 1337. 1337. No, you I want. You have 1738. I, want... I was going to say 1738. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you'll say 8008. <laughs> hey, hey, you. What happens if we put these on? Uh, well, uh, I feel like a trap crate, right? <laughs> okay, it'll just be cool. Should I put it on? Probably. Um, I think it, it'll move around without getting... The shadows you hear, wear the uniforms, don't get me caught. Go wherever hey, you go. What? I don't know if it has wing holes. <laughs> it, it very much does not. Your wings are going to be cramped and uncomfortable. Like lumps in your back. Yeah. Like they try to come out the top, but they like so they try to come out the bottom. It's like feathers everywhere. Yeah, they're just like, <laughs> like a bird fluffy. Is it out of curiosity? Is it like impossible that there would be like an aerial elf working here normally? Pretty much, yeah. Okay, so we need to hide a lot that. of humans in the same way that my tail is not hidden. There'd be a lot of humans, dwarves, maybe a few halflings. I don't exactly. belong here either, so yeah. I'm stealth route. I'm just gonna go back yeah. to the night stalker mode. Hairless bipedals. No. You know what? In that case, I do have some manacles. Do, what if? Because uh, I'm not going to be able to hide well. What if I just sort of have them on as your? What if like, I give you my mask of many? Oh. Ooh. Are you allowed to? I don't know. It's not your certification. <laughs> so I'll let I, you guys. I don't think that. that's how that works. Uh, uh, I'll, I'll, just, I'll just be your prisoner then, if that's okay. okay. That's fine with me. Yeah, I'll just have manacles on. Come on. What, uh, what about me? <laughs> uh, I mean, I assume if you just cover up your wings and put a helmet on, they, you could. They, 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 they are. They're, it's going to be uncomfortable. You'll, you know, you just wear a cloak. Yeah. I'm going to ask why you got a lumpy back. Well, it's like that's just the way you report. That's lump, yeah, that's lumpy back. Yeah, she works here. You know what? Like, Forge my lumpy back. <laughs> I've got my. Uh, uh, we established that mine's bigger, and now I'm going to just be a prisoner. So, what if we just give you my bigger one? Oh, oh there yeah, we go. Uh, yeah. Your coat. Yes. For me? The, the sacred 67. <laughs> um, yes. Okay. It's yours. Got it. Mr. Let's do this. All right. Uh, I mean, if I'm 1738, technically. Or 60. The, higher, the, the, the lower the number, the higher the rank. Behind me! So, uh, <laughs> if uh, if anyone asks questions, maybe just hey, my uh, squire will tell. That squire will tell. Perfect. Lead the way. Heading off into the uh, the uh, sickly lit green halls of this fortress, uh, we shall continue with the adventure next time. I totally forgot that it was like the episode was gonna end. I'm like, all right, what's happening next? <laughs> yeah, I, I, that's I. I think I like semi shut down at the end because I was like, all right, oh we're walking, along. all right, all right, oh we're still gonna okay. Like I was, yeah, <laughs> I kept thinking it was the end. Sorry.